Odie the octopus swam home. He swam at a constant speed. He plotted how far he'd gone every one-seventh of a second. There's a little typo here. This should just be one-seventh of a second on the graph below. Not all octopi can create graphs, but Odie was no ordinary octopus. And actually, octopi are some of the smartest creatures on this planet. What was Odie's speed after, after probably dolphins and, and great apes and probably most primates? And, but, but they're still fairly smart, smarter than most fish. What was Odie's speed in meters per second? Note we use, we use m slash s to show the units of meters per second. Meters per second. All right, so to figure out speed, to figure out speed in meters per second, we essentially need to, fit, we need to divide distance in meters, distance in meters, divided by time in seconds. Time in seconds. So let's see if we can pull that off. So the easiest thing, let's, let me find a point that I can clearly read how far OD has traveled. So it looks like this point right over here, it's clearly that the distance in meters is 4 sevenths. So let me do that. So the distance in meters is 4 sevenths. So I'll do that in the numerator, the distance in meters. See, I don't like that, con well, I'll just go with this color, even though the contrast with the white background is a little hard on the eye. And it took him, it took him 5 sevenths of a second, 5 sevenths of a second to go up there. So 4 sevenths meters. Let me make sure I put the units here. Four sevenths meters in in five sevenths five sevenths seconds, and so literally we just need to divide four sevenths by five sevenths, and and we're going to get it in meters per second. So this is going to be the same thing as four sevenths over five sevenths over five sevenths meters per second, meters per second. And 4 sevenths divided by 5 sevenths is the same thing as 4 sevenths times 7 fifths. So let me write that down. So 4 sevenths times 7 fifths. Dividing by a fraction is the same thing as multiplying by its reciprocal. So times 7 fifths. And we get, we get this, well, this 7 and this 7 and this 7 cancel out. You get 4 over 5. You could have also done that by multiplying the numerator and the denominator here by 7. If you multiply by 7, multiply by 7, you would get 4 fifths. But either way, his speed in meters per second is 4 fifths meters per second.